the first question is, uh, if you're at home and you're going to put on an album and you're going to listen to it front to back with no skips, do you know whose album you would reach for first? Gillian Welch, Time the Revelator. That is like, I do this thing where I like to just get drunk in the bathtub, light some candles, take a bottle of red wine. And that's just my go-to top to bottom, no skips. Perfect. Uh, the second question is, we already talked about um, all the, the fantastic duets and features you've got on the deluxe version of the record, but is there someone that's still at the top of your wish list that you haven't worked with yet? Dolly. Yeah. Dolly Parton. I love Phoebe Bridgers too right now. I would, I would love to collab with her at some point. Those are both wins. You, yeah. Those are both wins. Yeah. Uh, the third question is when we can all get back out uh, to live music and you can get on the road and, and pack up your guitar in the band. Is there a dream stage? somewhere that you can't wait to get to? Yeah, I mean, the Ryman Auditorium. I know that's right in the backyard, but the Ryman is a holy place to me, and I would love to get to play that stage. Yeah. Uh, the fourth question is, uh, on the same lines of when we're all back to a little bit of normal, if, uh, if I said to you, Haley, I need you to take two weeks off and not play guitar and not write a song, do you have a vacation spot you would jet away to? Whoo! Probably many, man, I'm down in New Orleans now. So that one's kind of checked off the list. Where else do I want to go? Canada. Yeah, come on up. Canada, I mean, I really would. Like, I'd love to get up there. I'm supposed to come up and play, honestly, Boots and Hearts. And I've just gotten to talk to everybody all day and I would love to come up there. All right, well, let's make it happen. Yeah. Uh, and then the last question, Haley, is one we ask everybody uh, when we play this. Is there an artist that makes any kind of music uh, that you think people should be paying more attention to than maybe they are right now? Mm, that's a good question. Um, I am a big Stephanie Lambring fan. Uh, she's a friend. She put out a record this year. She's another um, kind of, you know, she had gone back to waiting tables and, and made a record. And it's a really, really great record. And I think she's doing it um, pretty independently right now. And uh, she wrote all the songs 100%, just all her, produced the record with her buddy, um, I'm blanking on his name right now. But Stephanie Lambring, man, check her out. Perfect. That's five quick questions. We did it. Yeah. Right on. Thank you, Haley.